the pincers of a crab louse, a dust mite, red blood cells, and human immune cells in a battle against roundworms. These unusual glimpses into the microcosmos are the creations of a photographer and a biologist. They work mainly for chemical and pharmaceutical firms, and they specialize in artistic representations of scientific research. People are always fascinated by seeing things they've never seen before, things they might not even have realized exist. And this fascination, together with the photographic composition as a whole, can be a lot of fun. A leaf will reveal its invisible components when it's magnified by a factor of tens of thousands. The specimens are first treated with alcohol and meticulously prepared for the microscope. As a child, Oliver Mekis was fascinated by small objects he could see under a microscope. Today, his cellar looks like a high-tech laboratory. He and his partner have invested hundreds of thousands of euros in the equipment. These experts in microphotography opened the Eye of Science agency 16 years ago. Meanwhile, they're among the best in their field. With a scanning electron microscope, they capture objects too small to be seen with the naked eye to expose a fascinating world beyond human vision. The result is images of complex beauty created through the interplay between the world of science and the world of art.